Salut, David Allman here, and I wanted to talk to you a little bit about bending. Sometimes I feel that bending is a little bit too predictable. We kind of tend to be stuck in the comfort zones. That's something that's proper to every guitar player. Why would you do something the complicated way if you can do it the easy way? Shortcuts are good, but sometimes you're missing out by taking the longer route, and you're missing out on some new ideas. This is one of these ideas that you might not have thought about, and hopefully it will inspire you some new musical ideas. Instead of bending from a note that is in to another note that is in, example, the blues, you know, that bend that we all do on the third string with the ring finger, the blues scale, we all do that, right? Instead of doing that, just bend from a note that is outside of the scale, a wrong note, that is one half step below a note that is within the scale, and bend a half step up so that you land right on the targeted note. If I'm aiming for a note that is on the second string eighth fret, I would bend the second string seventh fret just a half step up. A very simple way to practice this is to take a scale that you're used to, minor pentatonic maybe, and instead of playing the notes of the minor pentatonic scale, just play the same shape a half step below, one fret below, and each note that you're playing, you're gonna bend it a half step up, trying to aim for that note that is in. If you can do that with your four fingers, the half step bend, you're gonna be good to go in any given situation. If you wanna sound even more expressive on your instrument, use your fingers instead of the pick. gonna make a difference I think between someone who sounds predictable and someone who sounds a little bit more expressive and less predictable so try it out I hope you enjoy this if you want to practice short ideas like this one the best backing tracks are just vamps short vamps that are gonna groove a strong groove foundation and they're gonna help you develop these ideas into your own playing I recommend the funk backing track pack the first and the second, they're awesome packs. I think I use them all the time. That's how I came up with this short idea. I hope to see you in July. Online live masterclass every Sunday of July. It's gonna be great. We're gonna talk about intervals, music theory, technique, and music business a little bit too. So come on over, 50 bucks give you access to all the lessons and it's really going to change your playing, I think. Anyways, thanks for watching this. I'll see you next time and until then, uh, salut.